Hi, I'm Colm from Vacuum Insulated Glass Australia, Vega, and we're here with Joe who has just installed vacuum insulated glass in his whole house. So we're going to talk to Joe about how he came to decide to do this. This is the first house in Australia that's been completely reglazed with Glavenier, which is 6.1 millimetres thick and is manufactured by Panasonic. So, Joe, you must have done a lot of homework before you made such a big decision. I did do a lot of homework and uh, I was more than pleasantly surprised when I, uh, that, that my research showed uh, vacuum double insulated glass from uh, Panasonic uh, performed better than triple glazing and would fit, and more importantly, would fit into uh, my existing window frames. And are they the, were they the key things? Because you could have replaced all the windows. Yeah, look, it, it was the key thing. The, the key thing was the style of house meant that we really wanted to retain the timber window frames for no other reason other than we thought the timber window frames were a better fit to the, to the house. Glavenier, the Panasonic vacuum double glazing, uh, was able to, we were able to retain the uh, original window frame. So I have to ask you, one of the issues with vacuum insulated glass is because the space between the two pieces of glass is in fact a vacuum, mm. there are little pillars at regular intervals mm. through the glass that are visible on close inspection. Mm. What was your response to that? Uh, look, if you go looking for them, they're there, but you have to look very hard. Um, we look through the glass, not at the glass. I, I, on occasions I've tried to point them out to people and I have to really put my glasses on and focus really on the glass. Uh, to actually see the little dots. Okay. Um, so they're not, they're not, you don't hear objections or you don't Not hear at all, yeah. not at all. Uh, we look through the glass, not look at the glass yeah. and the little spaces are invisible. Okay, so in terms of thermal performance, how has it been? Uh, it's been fantastic and the best example I can give you in you know, this climate in southern Tasmania, we can have uh, a warmish day, 24, 25 degrees during the day uh, a cool night of um, six, seven, eight degrees. Um, when we go to bed at night time, the house could be at a steady 24 degrees. When we wake up in the morning, it's at, uh, the house is still at 20 degrees. So uh, the house is, with the double glazing, has um, really kept its warmth and its thermal properties are just fantastic. And you mentioned to me that you think that the air ducted heating is kicking in less because it's thermostat controlled, is that...? Our only source of heating for the house is a ducted air conditioning system and it was noticeable to me on the very first day that the system hardly seemed to work. It hardly works during the day and it hardly works during the evening. Uh, I expect a huge saving on my electricity bill uh, come the end of next winter. Fantastic. So would it be fair to say that you, you're now a, an advocate of vacuum Absolutely. insulated glass? Absolutely. I wish I'd bought into the company. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Thanks, Joe. All right. Well, that's a story from Vacuum Insulated Glass Australia in the first house that we've done. And if we can end up with customers like that every time we do a job, the future looks bright.